Hello everyone, today I'm going to be looking through my art notebook, or binder, and I haven't looked through this for like, a long time, like, over a year, so this could be as interesting for me as for you. Maybe a little less, but, you know. So, the first page, it's a gun, okay, uh, uh, let's just flip the page. A Lego brick, okay, I drew a porg. I've drawn a lot of these porgs. I've drawn a lot of Star Wars stuff. Horse, I forget his name. But I think he's Star Wars, I don't remember. This is my face. It doesn't really look that great, but yeah. A, uh, what are these called? Some kind of, mm, I forget what they're called. Uh, a cartoon. I drew a hand here. This is actually a kind of cool one. Uh, it could either be mountains from the top or mountains from over here. So I drew it so both ways it could look like mountains. But as you can see, there's stuff there. So it's supposed to. This is actually a canyon we have by my house, and you just drive through there. So this is the bottom. A little color palette. I did. I drew a lot of this for my art class, but a swan. Another cartoon. Boba Fett. Some Star Wars characters: uh, Darth Vader, Mace Windu, Greedo, a Scout Trooper, and I think that's Jyn or so. I'm not sure. And then Chewbacca looking at a porg. Ray and BB-8, Han Solo, with his son Kylo Ren, a really cool Stormtrooper helmet, at least I think it's really cool, a colorful dove, desk with some Colorado stuff on it, and a flower, sunflower I think. One of my teachers, I drew, I drew this in 30 minutes, and he looks hideous. This was my... um rough draft for this famous Michelangelo painting and this was my final draft this is a lamp of course um this was using ink black ink Indian ink and I drew some shades uh, starting dark and going light and then I drew some objects with their shadows a coffee mug or some kind of mug holding four crayons I guess a microwave. This one's bad. This is looking out my window. That one isn't that great either. A real size drill gun or screw gun. This is real size. I detailed it as much as I can. And then a very close up image of a leaf. A dog. I think it's like some kind of husky mix. This is from a cartoon. I don't even know what it is anymore. I drew that quite a long time ago. Darth Vader, this is actually from a Star Wars shirt that I have, um, soap, dish soap, I don't know why I drew that, it's good to draw things like that because it kind of gets your creative juices flowing, whatever, I don't know what I'm talking about, uh, glasses, a pencil, and paper, that is one of my worst drawings, that I didn't use a ruler for, so look how crooked that pencil is, um, looking out of our truck, I drew something out here, I guess, and I erased it all, so it kind of looks very interesting, to say the least. Okay, we're moving on from that. Uh, a laptop. This was my old laptop. That's a very poor drawing. Uh, oh my gosh, what is that? That is the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Ahsoka drawing. I drew that and then colored it. This is a copy of what I drew because I didn't want to draw my I didn't want to color my original drawing. This is also a copy of what I drew. Um this is an original drawing. A bosque. A goat in the moon or the sun. A gate with flowers, I guess. Uh wow. Okay. This is my baseball team, I guess. Uh 
I don't remember drawing this one. I don't like the words up there. Ara Singh. Darth Maul. This is also a copy of my drawing. Another Darth Maul copy of my drawing. Here's my original Darth Maul drawing. That is not a copy. A salamander, some kind of lizard on a rock. A very undetailed sketch of a puma. R2-D2, of course. Sith Inquisitor. Um, Ray holding a porg to Kylo Ren, I guess. Well, why do I say I guess? Because it's obviously what that is. Um, Svajra Press. And another Chewbacca with a porg on his shoulder this time. What is that? Okay, it's mountains. Snow on the peaks. And one star. And over here, the moon. And then a Yoda. This I actually printed off the internet, I think. This I didn't draw. I'm not that good. A flag with a firework. Um, I was drawing whatever his name is from Zootopia, the fox guy. And I drew his shirt, but I didn't draw the rest of him. I probably never will. This is Luke Skywalker from Last Jedi. Captain Rex. This was using the Indian ink with soap. It gets this cool bubbly effect and kind of a low color in there. That one's pretty cool. Oh, this is one of my old ones. This is like three years old, but it's actually really good for what I drew. Um, it's a raccoon wearing clothes and playing a violin, which is my favorite instrument. That is curved so weird. I don't like that violin. That's bad. And now a koala playing a cello. A lion. I like this style of drawing. I think I did a lot of those. Oh, yeah. Uh, a tiger. This is the original Darth Maul drawing that is not a copy. The original Soka drawing and original Asajj Ventress. This is black ink, same ink with leaves. So you dip the leaf in and you print it on. Pretty cool. This I didn't finish. This is BB-8 with some kind of food stuff up there. No, that's Ray sitting at a desk. Okay, that's Ray. There's her head. There's her pencil. She's sitting at a desk, and that is supposed to be a Darth Vader stuffed animal, but I didn't finish that one, probably never will. This one is a fruit bowl. I think everything turned out okay except the pineapple. I don't really, I didn't look at one, so I didn't, I don't know why I wrote observational. It's not observational. I lied a lot for the class on things that were ob observational, but this is the original uh, Luma, Luminara Unduli drawing. It looks like she has a beard. Uh, Asajj versus Ahsoka. A no, like, it's a single drawing. You don't lift up your pencil at all. And it's a pig, if you couldn't see. Or a boar. This one's definitely a pig because of the nose. And this is one of those same style drawings. It's a horse. I did a lot of those. This is another horse. This is another horse. A monkey. A, um, husky. Another horse, same style as I s showed before, it's a rhino. These are, again, one draw. Well, this one's using one line. This one uses two, but it's very minimalistic and it is pretty cool, I guess. This one is using one, two, three, four, five, so it's not one line, nor is that. But they're very minimalistic. I did a lot of these, wow. That, I think, is supposed to be a hummingbird. There's the eye, there's the beak, but I don't know. A dove, that one isn't that good. Um, uh, I don't know. This is a one line drawing with two faces connected. That one's actually pretty cool. Uh, a cute little pig in a mud bath. Darth Vader, that one isn't that good. Um, a stormtrooper, again, not that good. Kenan Jarrus, this is a photocopy that I colored. And Ezra Bridger, wow. Okay, we're moving on from that to this adorable little pug. Well, that's kind of cute. Um, that is a photocopy. I don't know why I have that in here. That is my original Ezra Bridger. And my original Kanan Jarrus. And then two horses fighting. Or whatever you think they're doing. And this is an original um, drawing. And these are two photocopies. I was going to draw that, but I never got to it. This is a color photocopy of this um and then i have a conductor here that's actually one of my better drawings this is like the greek olympian gods 
in clouds, I guess. Um, these are some things I was planning on drawing again. I was planning on drawing that. I think I, I drew that one. Um, a swan. More drawings I was planning on drawing. Okay, this is empty. I know it has some things in it. More things I was planning on drawing. Okay, uh, a river with some trees. 2017, wow. Um, some mountains over there. Colorful mountains. I photocopied a lot of these guys and then like colored them to be their character. That's Jesse. More mountains. I don't like this mountain, but the rest is okay. This one I colored to be the horn leader. No, that's not. I don't know. Uh, K2SO or K2SO. Yoda. A Lego version. And this is me. I did this for my art class. This one was... um. Some kind of, I forget what it's called, but it's like a justice drawing, and it's me as who I am, and then me as a dark skin person. Um, it's kind of like, uh, you know, kind of, there's so many people. Oh, my camera's focusing on the face. That's when you know it's good, if the camera recognizes it as a face. But this was like a justice drawing, like, you know, people get, um, there's a lot of racism, so this was kind of for that. Um. That's pretty cool. Uh, a bird in a tree. A fridge. A lamp on desk. This one's pretty detailed. And this one, I used the Indian ink and then some red watercolors. And I think it turned out pretty cool. It's a butterfly, obviously. Some brushes in a clear jar. This one took a long time. This is a owl. Um, Very detailed, if I do say so myself. This is our little light hanging from the ceiling. Yeah, this is something I drew for my art teacher. Um, these are two, uh, well, that's bad. It took me 20 minutes to draw, oh, I lied a lot on these. It took me, like, five minutes, and then I need, like, 20 minutes to count when I turn in, so I feel bad. But I tried drawing my sister. She looks so creepy, and that's bad. I don't like that one. A microwave, again, with some cupboards. That one's very detailed, like... That one took, like, all day. That's super detailed. Um, Commander Cody, I colored. Clone Commander Wolf, I colored. This was, like, using weird shapes. It can either be a human head or a dinosaur head. That's kind of interesting, I guess. More leaves. Clone Commander Kiwi. I drew a lot of this. This is a photocopy that I colored. This is also a photocopy that I colored. And I... Another photocopy I colored. Another photocopy I colored. Um, a penguin. The more you look at it, the creepier it gets. Just keep looking, and it'll get so much creepier. Um, more of this art stuff. Joker or clown lips with a smile. I drew a lot of clowns. Clown, clown, clown. This one's pretty cool, actually. Bosk that I colored. Uh, flowers. This is like my background for my old computer. I think that looks pretty cool with the colors. A little flower jar thing. This is actually my very favorite drawing I've ever drawn. The mirror. It's actually not a drawing, it's painting. I didn't even draw anything under it. I just started painting and I think it turned out super cool. This is definitely my favorite. I'm very, very proud of this piece right here. Um, and then I drew some trees that are dead. And then this is my original drawing of my face. And so, yeah. And then over here we have, I don't know, we're just going to skip over that one and go to this one, which is more of the art of, what, well, more of the black paint-ish ink. It's ink. Uh, I made a tree with leaves. Um, I dipped leaves and then turned it into a tree and then drew a trunk. And then same with this sunflower dandelion whatever it is mountains behind my house uh that's not good especially right here in that area over here we have a cabin Greedo, photocopy i colored batman and wolverine this one's actually pretty detailed for 10 minutes this is a rough sketch of a dog i was drawing i never finished that one but i think it looks cool as a sketch this is like a winter church, it says. Okay, next is a candle. Um, 
this I drew around Christmas. It was kind of inspired by a uh, book I read, so yeah. This is actually an observational shoe. I don't have the shoe anymore, but that's actually a pretty detailed drawing. It took me two days to draw that. Not straight, obviously. It was, like, only, like, five hours. Um, a horse. Another dog. I love drawing animals, as you can see in Star Wars. A seagull. This is when I visited the beach. I just took out my crayons or whatever, colored pencils, and just drew that really quick at the sunset. Then I drew that bird as it was flying away, but it got away, and so I didn't... It doesn't really look finished, especially the belly. But I drew another character from the cartoon that I remember. And then this is some... What we would do in class is someone would do a posture and they'd hold it for three seconds and we had to sketch it out quickly. If you look closely, you can see a face, smile, nose, and mouth. Um, You can see some different things, but yeah. A lot of those. And they're way too interesting. A stapler, that's actually pretty nice. A couch with a deer blanket. Um, some lights, a teapot, another cute doggo, a creepy cat, all cats are creepy, scissors, uh, what's this? That's a microphone, this is one of those sliders, and that's a button. I actually do a radio station, and so I just copied it from mine, my, from the radio station, and here is another color of a photocopy. I messed up. He doesn't have lines on his legs. He doesn't have a lot of those lines. A cat. Another cat. Just same cat. This is actually one of my favorites. This is um, Jabba's little monkey dude. That's one of my very favorite pictures I've ever drawn. This is one of my favorites as well. That's Ray with the staff in front of her face so I didn't have to draw the other eye. But the staff did turn out super cool. There is because, like, you can't draw one eye and then copy it the exact same on the other side. So, staff in front just really helps. Um, there's Darth Vader. That's a lot better than the first one. This one was amazing until I added the dark lines. That ruined it. So, I'm sad about that. But, some more pogues. P pogues? <laughs> some more porgs with um, different expressions. That one's inquisitive, I guess. That one's yelling. And that one's sad when he sees Chewbacca eating his fellow porg. This one I never finished, that's a dog eating cupcake. Bomb Squad Trooper. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna skip through all these, no one cares about these. A lion, that one's actually interesting. This is Zebrelius, I think his name is. Aurelius, oh whatever. Sabine Wren, um, Sabine Wren again. BB-8, Poe and Finn. No one cares about that. A cheetah, I way messed up on the other side, so I just drew a black bar in front of it. I think that turned out okay. R2 and or D2, I should probably erase those words, but it's like Death Star with all that stuff, and it's like in the shape of RTD2, kind of interesting. This one, one second, but this is um the all the characters from Rebels. I have, I'm going to get up for one second and try and find it. But I should have a picture of this. This was my original, and then I had it enlarged, and I colored it. But it's so big, I don't even know where I put it. Let me get up for a second, so stay there. Because it can't move, anyway. Um. Yeah, I don't know where I put it. That's a bummer. But, oh, while I got up, I found this. This is something I drew yesterday, just real quickly. That eye is giant, that one's small, but it's a cute little puppy who doesn't love a puppy. This is Obi-Wan from the Clone Wars. That one's actually pretty nice. And this is from the one in the snow. I don't know her name. She's blue. This is Cat Rex and Ahsoka. This is perspective, so it starts out and goes so it just looks like it's going into the sun. Or into the distance with the skyscrapers and all that and then here is a human old man um with his lips his nose his eye but next is graffiti and a trash can i me and my cousin did a drawing contest and i won because he can't draw shh don't tell him he might watch this video i shouldn't have said that anyway um grand moff tarkin a stormtrooper Helmet, Savage Opress, Kylo Ren on this, and then this is a TV 
with a TV inside, with a TV inside, TV, TV, TV. I really, I used the sharpest pencil I could find and just drew it so many times. But, yeah, it's someone watching TV of someone watching TV of someone watching TV of someone watching TV, and you can go forever. I thought that was kind of cool. This is a creepy zombie cat. Uh, this is a cobra. I actually think that one turned out pretty interesting. This is my old phone. And, yeah, I draw all the apps and all that. This is a charcoal drawing of a rose. And I just used some colors just to, so you can kind of tell a bit. Speaking of charcoal drawings, they're very messy, as you can see. This, I drew a heart, but it's, like, you know, twisted. It's kind of optical illusion-y, if that's not a word. Then I just made it up. This was a really cool sunset I saw. This doesn't really do it justice, but this was like a cartoon of it. That's my mom. When she's about 80, she's like 40 right now. And I, <laughs> I made her look so old. Oh my gosh. She looks about way better than that. That's like, that would be like 90. Like that's it. Yeah. Yeah. I drew an eagle. This one's pretty cool. It's like a bald eagle. That one's actually really cool. If I do say so myself. Um, I drew a lion with a bar. And I also drew a lion with a bar. They're the same picture. It's just one's longer. And they're both original. I both I caught I drew them both one after the other. So yeah. This is a guy charming a snake. Captain Rex helmet. An Indian and a horse and a teepee back there. That one's old and ugly. Um Okay, we're moving on from that one to this adorable pug looking at you like I'm hungry or whatever. A horse, another horse, two horses, and a dog wearing sunglasses because that's what dogs do. A black drawing with white uh, crayon. I like doing that kind. Changing out from white and black to black and white. Um, a cow painting. That's a painting of with watercolors, I think. There's another horse, one horse, two horse, three horse, four horse, and then another one of these crayon drawings. I do a lot of that. I did a lot of those. An ice cream cone, a melting ice cube. My dad. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wow. Actually, this one looks a lot like him. This is quite a bit what he looks like. Um, I think I did pretty good on that one. Except for the neck. That's kind of thin. But these were some kind of like tattoo ideas. I'm not going to get a tattoo, I don't think. But they were just some kind of cool ones. But that is a dragon eye with some, some scribbles around it. So it kind of ruined it. And that's another dragon eye. That one's kind of cool. Um, Spider-Man and Venom. I really, really, really like this one. Spider-Man and Venom. That's a pretty cool one, in my opinion. A caricature of Boba Fett. Caricature Shore Trooper, Caricature 501st Trooper, um, Caricature 501st Trooper again, and then some designs, you can just look at these, cause I don't really know what to talk about them about. Another Dragon Eye, this is my favorite one I did, um, yeah, a cute dog again, I love this kind of dog, but they're actually kind of mean, um, more of these, a lot more of these, I think these might be the, we're getting to the end, a Lego Brickheads, of Han Solo. Another horse. This one's kind of cool. Another flower. A watercolor flower. And this is from this morning. A video I just posted. And that is it. Except for a couple more things. Right here is a painting of a yellow rose. And over here is a horse. So... Yeah, I hope you all enjoyed, and if you would, then please subscribe. That would be awesome. You would make my day. This is actually my second video. My first video was, let me, was a speed drawing of this. I'm going to be, I, I'm going to, I'm going to be doing a lot more of those. Um, my voice is cracking so much now, because I've been talking for 24 minutes straight. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm... Probably next video I'm gonna do is gonna be in a while because I'm going to visit my grandpa and then yeah let me st let me stop the video on a cool drawing.
Uh, oh yeah, I know exactly the one. We we're gonna stop it on a. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find it. Oh wait, there it is. So anyway, thank you all for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment, and I will see you guys in the next video, which I'll probably be drawing my character for my profile picture because I just started this channel and I don't even have one yet. So thank you for watching. Bye.